I am back with another rant video that I am was not expecting to make so soon again. I am Fallen, and today we will be talking about Softy Starry, but with two X's in the spelling. It seems from my poll I did a few months ago that around 24% knows him from my channel which many people s said their experiences about him on there. And recently, some events sparked on the 7th that resulted in this video being made because he hasn't changed or stopped and it does not seem he like he plans on stopping. Even if you try to criticize him, I am pretty sure he will block you or delete your comment. So this video is being made as a warning and critique against him since you can't express your feelings to him on his channel. Just a reminder, no death threats to this person. That is not okay. You may not recognize him as Softy Starry, but he also went by Gotcha Villager the Gotcha Fan. Lunatic Gotcha Tuber, Softy Lunatic, and Softy Lunatic with a different spelling, and others too. On the outside, his channel doesn't seem unusual, but on the inside, where he comments on others and different channels, is very concerning. It is funny how the Gotcha community is toxic, but you play a part in the toxicity. First, the guilt tripping. Throughout this section, you will see a massive amount of guilt tripping from him. This is a very short section because this topic relates to the next three topics that are going to be discussed. And this topic is important, but not as important and striking as next three. This is one of the problems about Softy Starry, as you will see further on from his messages. Second, Asian Hate. This is again another short topic since it is related to the next topic, but what is wrong with you? I am guessing these messages are all towards Danya. I would like to mention has done some controversial things themselves, though this video is about Softy and he has no right to say these things. Third, the weird comments. Now this is one of my main problems that the majority of people may have seen before. You will end up seeing the weirdest comments. And when he came to my channel, they were okay at first until they got weirder and stranger to the point that he spammed them and not just through my channel but other channels too. Like no one is giving me anything for my birthday or no one is making me gifts. But many people gave you gifts, though I heard you never responded to them. And if they were bad, that is the only time you would respond to them. Also, you say you are sorry, but it seems like you can't be trusted and left the biggest problem of why people are mad at you out of this message. This leads to my last point, the threatening and baiting requests. You have threatened many people into doing things for you and banging yourself a lot of times for gifts. You shouldn't kill yourself over not getting something, nor should you be baiting to get your way. That trick doesn't work anymore, since many people now know how you lie and how you do this to many, and I mean many, people. If he does this to you, do not trust it. I can't count how many times he has suicide baited people into doing things for him. You are in control of your own channel, and he is not. He can't force you to make stuff for him on your channel. Also, this is why people have a hard time actually communing their problems if they are troubled. Because they are seen as liars and fakers while you are the real faker. You're one of the problems to the gotcha community. Yes, I am being very harsh because this hits very hard to me because I have a friend who actually is depressed and has thoughts of suicide and trouble telling someone about it and I spent the whole month being worried for him while he went through that. 
In the end, if you see this person and you are uncomfortable and if he tries to bait you, don't trust him and block him. There is no trying to talk to him because he is on repeat. You've seen it himself, how he says sorry yet is not actually truly sorry. Death threats will not help the situation, but let's give him his wish of actually feeling ignored by many. To his fans or friends, it is your choice if you want to still be with him and watch him though his actions are out there now and you can't really defend him for doing this stuff. Or perhaps you're unaware of all this. He has done this constantly and repeatedly. If he's going to block and ignore people's voices, then might as well use videos to voice that opinion. Feel free to comment if I missed anything or your own experience with this person if you are comfortable with it. Now, I really hope I am not coming back for a while, but I may just jinx myself again. We will see if something sparks up again, but seriously, this year already has been drama filled. This video is just adding fuel to the fire, but this began in 2023 and has extended, so I just wanted to warn others about this person. Don't feel threatened or forced to make a gift for this person if they come up to you asking for a gift like this. Now, goodbye. This is Softy, someone I've featured in videos before. He pinned this after he mentioned it was the one year anniversary of my uncle's death. He has been extra self centered and careless when it comes to others' feelings. This SS is from my birthday. The video he sent was a month old. He begged me to make the video I linked. And you can see he got upset when didn't make a custom thumbnail. Keep in mind he's 17. The next screenshot set speak for itself. This is a friend of mine's screenies. Suicide baiting and threatening to quit over small things. And yet ignored a gift from my friend. Now his age is important here. These next screenshots are from a 14 year old. Again, keep in mind he's 17. Again, he's 17, they're 14, and yes, I have permission. To show the victim's useress for he unadded me and Kamiko, Lil Dan on a debt safety themselves, please report him on YouTube and Discord, which is show next. He also tried to use autism awesome on excuse for his actions. And when I tried to talk to him like an adult in his Discord server, he banned me for disturbing. Disclaimers I'm gonna make sure everyone knows what you've done, softy. This means war. You've hurt so many. Why don't you just own up to it? This could end your career. So, what are you doing, softy?